All right, folks, the deck is Even Hunter. The goal of the deck is to restore balance to the metagame by offsetting some of the odd hunters with Even Hunter for net neutral. Essentially, we just press the hero power button a few times, pull secrets from our deck, and eventually make our opponent dead. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash Rumble. Watch this! Yep. Keep the Skyantist and, uh... Sure, yeah, this is a good hand. Concede to Horde players? Yeah, that would be one way to get the Golden Drek'thar. It is pretty five-head. Wonder what my turn one play is going to be. Up call. Aim for the wheels. So it's not Cthune. We've been seeing a like a linecracker druid popping up. So maybe it's that. Because you actually don't need alignment for Linecracker to work. No. It's leaning more towards Maligos, isn't it? So, pressure plate's going to be good. And uh, timing of the ice trap is also important. And I need to remember the new cost of uh, alignment. Could be Yogg Jade. I mean, the breath. Ramping there kind of indicates that they're running dragons, right? That said, there is like a version of uh, Jade Druid that is running Mali Ghost to like fetch the uh, like the new Mali Ghost to fetch all the idols, and I think that's a pretty good idea. Okay, got a pressure plate though. Also, pretty nice to have a backup pressure plate. Just need to swing in case I hit like the rifle or anything. Probably have to test for ice trap, which means they proc the. Uh... Bummer, but I do get an honor kill on the weapon. It's not necessarily expecting. I think I can go here now. And uh, we're presenting lethal even through a coin alignment here. So this is also after. So even if they have a spreading plague, one of them dies. Okay. Definitely looking like Mally goes around. Which also means the pressure plate uh, can be useful. But this ice trap is now less exposed. Still can't get to the alignment here. Hey, welcome, Silver. Another ice trap seems good. I'll miss you too, Guff. This one might be a little bit more difficult. The secrets are more geared towards um, spells, which this deck does not run, so. Fortunately, not as good of a met. Like, you could build this deck in order to farm Pirate Warrior, but like we've been seeing fewer Pirate Warriors at this rank, so I think it's just fine to like beat on Shamans like we have been. Also got a decent curve here. It's just, again, my literally none of my secrets do anything. <laughs> Unless they're running uh, Shiver. Okay. 
Unlucky. Wait, what? Uh. Okay. Or posted the stats 12% Pirate Warrior and Legend. I mean, that's. High Legend is very different than like mid tier to dumpster Legend, which is where I am. Like, those are two. Like, he's queuing into the same person <laughs> game after game at single digits. So that skews things quite a bit. Face? Keep going, face. Okay. One more time. Okay, this is actually starting to become concerning. Like, the benefit to pulling secrets at this point is that I don't draw them, but I need to take the cannon off the board. I legend top 100. I mean, even higher than that is where Corb tends to play, which you have an even more narrow range of uh, opponents to queue into. I think Tavish is maybe how I win this game, if I win this game. But, like, people's definition of what constitutes high legend varies dramatically, so there's, like, no real answer to what is high legend. to relieve some of the board pressure. Maybe that was too cowardly, but they're showing quite a bit of damage. And with the Tavish set up, I might be able to stabilize. We're gonna need more or not. It's a devastating turn. Fortunately, there's no good place for these to hit. Glory. I'm here for the Base? Well, <laughs> never before has there been a greater need for improved explosive trap. No captain, please. Although the captain dies himself. Grab your cutlass. Let's buckle swash. Set sail. The juggernaut is under my command. Oh, those are the best hits. I've got the uh, pack tactics up, right? That's a target for piercing shot. I just need one of these to hit their face. Oh, no.
Doesn't matter. Always hover. Never hover. Okay. Uh, Free Shaman is a much more palatable matchup with this deck. I think I coin out a face stalker if I can. Seems relatively safe into Shaman. It's maybe better to coin out actually. Tempting to get Bloodseeker value here, but that's always going to be available. I want to get Face Stalker and um, Bellwing. Well, no. I can still get Bellwing down here with this play. And now, even if they clear this, I have Face Stalker here, power next turn. Oh, okay. Um. Uh, Probably a nice fishing, but get a big weapon. Um, they can't go Blurgle Tox this turn with the ice fishing. The new two-two weapon doing better than you for you than Glavezuka. I mean, it certainly is this game. It's currently a four-two. Did he get? Yep. Honestly, it's tempting to keep here just to get uh, Ice Block. Bring Trap, maybe? I wouldn't... No. I wouldn't run a 4-mana card. Just run either another Secret or another good 2-mana card. Double Phase Stalker. Seems twice we as good. Our curse into our Oof. It's just Dirty Rat protection, right? Because they always coin a Dirty Rat here. Huh. I must not be playing against a member of Twitch chat. Well, yeah, you're in Legend. I mean, the way Twitch chat talks, like, they know everything, so why wouldn't they also be in Legend? Smart. That's unfortunate. Face, face, face. <laughs> you can't keep getting away with it. Another one. Oh, that's a dangerous 50 50, you know, isn't it? Oh, wait. Do I even have the. I have to have the. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's a dangerous 50 50 now, isn't it? Mm. Oh, my God. I am the champion. Of 50 percenters.
All right, they do have healing, but less healing than before. Because of the loss or nerf to... Oh my god, what if they just, like... What if they heal and then tap that? I see you. hey -o! Didn't even need a spell there. My elements are frightful. My Shaman. Just coin neophyte into neophyte into face stock. I don't know. That's, that seems silly, but I'm gonna do it. You can't you can't play wind chills if uh if I keep chaining neophytes, right? Oof. Some sweet, sweet dirty rat protection. Hey, welcome, Jellycat. Jellycat, thank you for the 37 months. It's been quite some some time since I've done that. I mean, I appreciate it, and it's been a long time since the first time, so thank you so much. Really appreciate that continued support. Let's keep, uh, keep with the game plan. Uh-oh. Might need to trade into that, right? They did draw two spells, so it could be Devolve, which this will probably bait out. What did we hit? Pressure plate? Do I need to kill that? The opponent has a face. Yeah, they're going to make that trade for me. Why do it? Okay. Found the tech shaman, I guess. Armor, armor. Like armor. Such a armor, Rude. Armor. Used armor. For the mock Got all my secrets out anyway, so. Nobody moved, and no one gets hurt. How come no spring the trap? Uh, I mean, there are. There's one secret left in my deck, and it's turn six, so it's just not likely to get a lot of value. Ah. Uh, This is the season. No. Hit this, hit this, hit this. Pressure play, come on. Oh! I am so good. It's not like a real card against me, though. So. Rats off to you. Uh, so I've got 10, 14, 16. I'm one damage off legal. I don't want to leave them at one because they do appear to be Reno right now. Let me double check this. Oh, wait, no, I've got this as well. It's lethal. Or, yeah. 12, 14... 12, 16, 20. You're dead. I did the opposite of Twitch mana. I thought I had one less mana than I actually did. All well, the recent quests, which one is your favorite? Uh, can I choose none of them? Maybe the Demon Hunter one. 
Let's ramp up a Bloodseeker here. Or just chain Neophytes again, that was fun. Paladin Quest, because it's the only bad one? I mean, Rogue would like a word with you, as would Priest. And Shaman. I mean, there are quite a few bad ones in Wild, in particular. Like, there's essentially only two relevant ones in Wild, maybe three. Yeah, looks like the burn deck, so maybe I hold back the, uh... I do want to get the pressure plate down early if I can, but I don't think this is necessarily the, tur the turn. This is the Drek'thar turn, but like it's not a good combo turn necessarily. And a lot of my secrets interact with uh, spells, so... It's fine. This might be a Neophyte turn, just Neophyte pressure plate, but then I'm not hero powering. Maybe I pressure plate hero power. I do want to get the ice trap out of my deck. If I punch here, what is next turn? Next turn is um, Neophyte hero power plus a two drop. I'm always playing the Neophyte, so I won't play a rifle if I draw it. I would play a second Bloodseeker, though. I'm not going anywhere but face with this. So. And they're out of wind chills, so this feels fine. I think Guff is the coolest hero, even if it doesn't seem all that good. He's great and wild. Like, I think the Cthundurid is a real duck. Hey, J-Man. Oh, god, I forgot about that card. Yeah. This is good for locking them out for another turn. Pressure plate eventually gets the frog, right? Fine. By the wings. You better watch your step and None of those last ones were all that great. You're not going to be playing for board much, so. Oh, maybe they are. Okay. Huffer? Jeez. I guess double Leoc works as well. Oh hey, finally not a shaman. Victory for the Forsaken. By Fang and Claw. I wanna find Deadeye. Ice Trap is good, but um I'd rather pull it from my deck with the two secret fetches. So coin Deadeye into these two. Deadeye is likely to survive, although not guaranteed. Even versus odd. Our into our the ultimate! Go down. It makes it less likely that this dies, so happy to see that. They're probably just setting up hero powers here. Yep. It's going to be a little bit too slow against me, I think. That was the least likely secret we got. 
we would get, and uh, I think it's maybe the most helpful. Nope! <laughs> oh, I never thought I would ice trap a quest. <laughs> oh, yeah, get out of here. Come on. Mm. We just keep any two drop, I guess. This is a better one for turn two. We have turned our curse into our strength. Kind of weird. Dead on. Gotta go face here to get this down. Nature waits for no one but me. Kind of just been ignoring opposing minions. Well, maybe now I trade over that just to protect the face stalker. But at the same time, how important is it to protect the face stalker when I've got double scientist on board? They only drew one card. I'm going face. Pogo. I think they might have been better off just like clearing this board. Uh, I've got five damage after the Tox Fang comes down. No, four damage. I'm one off. I should have checked that. Maybe consider just piercing shotting my own minion. That said, we know they're not Reno. Right? So, I can just hold here. Oh, they're gonna get our Glen with the Mutana, so no. Bye, Glenn. Thank you to legendary patrons Brian Huynh, Fizzle Jizzix, Gian Rusi, Battlefly, Jeffrey Pierce, Justice Crater, Horback, Nogglesher, Nate Drex, Saint Arthur, Shadow1TV, Sognisman, and Vanfix. 